Everyone, oh no, I want to show the cartoon, show the cartoon. Oh, I'm sorry everyone, I clicked the mouse button and that came up. Welcome to a very special Scott Smitty Let's Play. This is EcoQuest, The Search for Cetus. And this game has a lot of uh, meaning to me. It's an edutainment game. I remember almost nothing about it, yet it was one of the first computer games I ever played. Definitely like the first point and click I ever played and my mom got it for me. My mom always loved point and click games back in the day. She had uh, uh, Monkey Island, the Journeyman series. She had all these point and click games and she got this one for me. We played it together and we never finished it. So, you know, uh, when I started doing Let's Plays, I knew this had to be on the short list because I remember it being pretty dopey and, you know, it's dedicated to my mom. Dedicated to you, Ma. We're going to finish it. We're going to finally finish... Uh, the search for Cetus. And here is a little happy little dolphin swimming around. Wow, that's a huge vibrating net. <laughs> wow. Aw, poor dolphin. That was really easy to avoid. Like, how did he not see this giant net? Oh, I guess that's kind of mean. But... Oh, you guys can't hear. Uh, the, unfortunately, the program I'm using to record this old game. Uh, you can't hear the midi, the MIDI music, but it, it's uh, very, it was very sad. <laughs> and there's Adam, our protagonist, and his dad. If you want to go join that volleyball game, Adam, it's okay by me. Why not take a break? I don't know why I gave the dad such a goofy voice. Adam, because <laughs> I wear a bathing suit and no shirt around the house sometimes. Um, I don't think so. I don't really know any of those kids. It's always that way when you move. Exposition. Sooner or later you'll make friends. It'll happen. Maybe. Sure. Maybe later. Look at it. Oh, he's not impressed. Look at those giant eyes on Adam. Bonk. Gonk. And the cursor's a little dolphin. Okay, lab rat. Oh, jeez, dad. If you're gonna stay, you're gonna work. If you're gonna stay inside. Come give me a hand with this. I got my little walk icon now. Okay, let's walk over to the box. Sure. What's up? I found another bird this morning. These oil spills make me so bad I can't see straight. Uh, unfortunately, that's not really funny. It's kind of sad that it's still happening nowadays. Anyway, let's see what we could do about it. Take her a closer look, then get a rag ready. Aw. The seagull is covered with oil and shivering miserably. Well, let's get this sponge, or uh, sorry, clean rag. And let's, ding, points, got two points. And touching the bird upside, no, I wanted to grab the soap. Our detergent, the seagull detergent. All right, now, um, I think you have to go to the items to mix them. No, I don't wanna, no, uh, my bag, my, my pack. And soap on the rag. Dish soap? that work? I mean, uh, maybe, I don't Adam's dad found a seagull coated with oil. I know, I was trying to... I was trying to rub it. Great, hold on a sec. Easy now, pal. Try to apply the soap with the grain of the feathers. That'll get most of the oil out without breaking them. Gross! Will the bird die? He might. Oh, jeez. Aw, he might. Depends how much of a shock he's had. We're doing all we can. Why don't you finish up? Scrub, 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 scrub. Uh, maybe not so violent, Adam. It made like a chainsaw sound. You guys couldn't hear it, but... Should I take him outside and let him go? Not just yet. The soap removes his natural oils, too. And that's what makes him float. He'd be short bait until they build up again. We'll take care of him and hope for the best. He'll probably die. <laughs> I wish there was something more to do. Me too. I feel like all we do is clean up after the fact. And it doesn't work too well. We're pretty bad at our jobs. Even the fertilizer solution I'm working on for cleaning up the... Okay, Dad, we get it. Too many factors like water, temperature, current, stuff like that. Here, you take it. I think this mix is better. It might even work on the coral a little bit. Try it out if you want. Blast! 
I'm late again. All these meetings are getting to me. What does he do for a living and what is he meeting with? So do you want to go outside or stay here and maybe work with the dolphin? He's not recovering well from being entangled in that drift net. He's probably going to die too. He could use some encouragement. Wow, can I work with the dolphin? Don't you need training or stuff with that? Yeah, go ahead. Just take a look at the instructions on the blackboard in the treat room first, though. We have to make sure we're all doing the same thing with him. Gotta run! Committees! <laughs> Why the random committees? Is that Dad's way of saying goodbye? Committees! Okay, whatever. Uh, I think we're supposed to pour the fertilizer in on the coral. Adam carefully pours some of the solution into the tank. Whoa! Bacteria from the fertilizer solution breaks down the oil into harmless chemicals. That would be handy. Okay. I better save this. Anyhow, the water's clean. Oh, yeah, no, I was just trying to... Okay. I think if I... Yeah, okay. Anything else in the box? See, Adam will take care of the bird until its natural oils coat its feathers. Then the bird will be able to float again. Can I poke it now? Seagull's already clean. Touching it any more might put it into deeper shock. Look at the, look at the eyeballs. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> this game is kind of funny sometimes. Let's look at it. Oh, that was it? Okay. Can we talk to the seagull? I want to talk to it. Poor guy. You'll get better. Don't worry. I guess, I guess I don't know what else I was expecting. What's on the blackboard? Transmitter here. Attached to float with cable. A shielded cable attaches the float to objects for salvage. Ah, I see. Okay. What's a raincoat? Adam's father keeps a rain here, coat here, but hardly ever uses it. Why? What's here? Oh, man, I forgot to give him the water. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Adam's gerbil lives in this cage. Jeez, he's... What the hell is that down here? That's a... Okay, whatever. Doom. Wow. He thinks he's in prison. Okay, okay, I get it. You're in prison. The gerbil doesn't want that! Yeah, let's clean him up. No, okay. All right, all right, I get it. Where's the... There it is. Let's put the water back on the... There you go, little fella. Adam attaches the full water bottle to the gerbil cage. Yay, look how happy he is. Water, I'm not gonna die. What? What is happening? He's doing a little soft chew. Oh, and you guys can't even hear the music that's got little doop do 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 I guess that hits the spot, huh? Makes you break out the little top hat and cane. Wow. Can I talk to him? Yakety yak, it doesn't talk back. Ha ha ha. Huh. Can I... <laughs> Adam shouldn't interfere with the gerbil's aerobic workout. Okay. It's got a little happy song. The gerbil's dancing. Okay. Alright. Okay. You almost done, gerbil? Nope, music's still going. He's still dancing. Um. Okay. I can't. Okay. Is he still dancing? No. Now he's. Okay. Gerbil's getting that heart rate up. Good. All right. Let's grab the hint book. Hint book. Rats. So you're just reading the hint book for the game. Ooh, let's bring these jaws with us. Do 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 do. Oh! Watch it, Adam. That creature hasn't had a snack for a few thousand years. Get it? Cause it's dead. Let's go touch the shelf. And, oh, well, Adam doesn't need anything on the shelf. Okay, what's on the shelf? What does anybody keep on shelves like these? I don't know, that's what I'm asking you, game. The rug in the shape of the planet Earth is Adam's favorite. He takes it wherever they move. Well, why wouldn't they? It's magic. It's got submarines and stuff popping out of it. All right, what's over here? What's on, what's on the walls? I want to get as many points as I can. I want to finish this. Dr. Noah Green, Dr. Philos Philosophy and Ecological Sciences. Phew, there's a mouthful. Adam did advanced scuba diving. This course was tough, so he's framed the certificate. Okay. It's on the computer. Can I touch it? 
Adam's dad is working on an article called Sonar Transmitters Revolutionize Toxic Salvage. An empty box has been left for a graphic with the note C blackboard diagram. Ah, I get it. What's on the bookshelf? 55 Fun Ways a Kid Can Make a World of Difference by Michael O'Brien. Neato, they put it in the EcoQuest box. Did this game come with like a, a, a little edutainment manual too? Ooh, I need some, need some soda. Picks up the empty soda can. Ah, I guess we're supposed to recycle. Edutainment and all that. Slam dunk! Even though I use my feet. Adam picks up the garbage bag. He plans to use it picking up trash. And he goes diving later. All right. Can I, get to, can I take these books? Maybe I'll put some of that info into my into my newsletter. I really don't have time right now. Whatever. Okay. Now oh, we got the envelope. Cool. My membership card. Well, we got oh, we got to recycle the bag. Oh, this is the bag icon. Okay. Well, I knew I, I know I know I'd get points if I whoa. That's a... Uh... Jordan, look out! Because Michael Jordan was known for paper airplanes. Okay, either way, I knew I would get points for that. Okay, um... Now, what do we pick up? We picked up this. Adam Green is a lifetime member of the Worldwide Dolphin Society. Ah, apprentice. Okay. All right, so Adam, despite being, like, what, 12, did complete some courses... All right, let's go to the other room to work with the dolphin. What? I, Dad didn't give me a code. All right, so what's the code? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Eco. Clear. Oh, that's clear. That's zero. Oops, try clicking the keys. I don't know. What? I don't even know what I did. Okay, whatever. The dolphin brought in by the fisherman is swimming in slow circles. The vet says it has capture stress syndrome. Oh, oh. Let's look around. We got a net. Where's my eyeball? There it is. Net is used to clean the pool. What's over here? Level of the water can be raised or lowered so that really sick animals can be walked. All right. That's really good. This is a good door leads back to the lab. Oh, we got to look at the... Reminder to all helpers, talk to the dolphin. See if he's hungry. Try swimming with him. Frisbee on counter. Whatever that means. Good luck, Dr. Green. Okay, set of instructions. Should all helpers treat the dolphin alike? Well, I assume this is the frisbee. Mine now. Okay. What are these, boats? Speedboats rest against the back wall. They're equipped with cages to protect any creatures that might swim too near. That's a good idea. All boats should have that. Um, oh, I gotta talk to him first, right? Okay. Uh... Hey, hi, hi, hey, oh, hey, hi, buddy. You're swimming better than yesterday. All right, uh, I guess again. You'll feel better in no time at all, and we can take you home. All right, so you've had a tough time, but we're not going to keep you or anything. We're just trying to help you get better. Adam's, Adam's soothing voice got through to him. Looks like he's decided to make friends. Yeah, baby, I got a real smoothing voice. Soothing, smoothing, soothing voice. Dolphin eyes the bucket by the door. I want some fish, asshole. Okay, let's get some fishy. All right, we'll get you some fish. Adam picks up a mackerel. And we'll throw it to him. Bonk. Dolphin chows down on the mackerel. I guess we'll keep doing it until something else happens. Adam picks up the mackerel. Good idea, but I'll just wait till the dolphin. Well, pay attention, you friggin' dolphin! Well, I need another mackerel now. But he still looks hungry. I'm getting the fish! Why? The dolphin's like. Good. What? Good idea, she wait till she's paying attention. The dolphin is paying attention! Take the mackerel! He was looking right at it! Oh, this... This dolphin's pushing my buttons already. Take the mackerel. It's right there. How many mackerels are on the bottom of the pool now? Go get him. Yes! He swallowed another one! Oh, 
All right now, what now when he stopped? Is that when he... Eat it, eat it. We. What? Well, I guess he's done. Well, screw you. Oh, I have to get in the pool now, I think. was that? All right, let's go. Doop, doop, doop. Hey, his shoes disappeared. Moving slowly and carefully, Adam climbs into the pool. He can feel the dolphins delight at having some company. To beat up. What is he doing? The weird clicking sound means the dolphin is memorizing Adam by bouncing sound waves off him. It's called a sonar click. Right before they eat meat. That was fun! Do it again! I like sonar bouncing off me. Hey, where are you going? Whoa! He went right into the net, or wall. Whoa! That pool's not deep enough. Whoa, good one! Bloosh, 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 bloosh. You're making me dizzy! I'm gonna drown! Uh, it's playing cheery music, I guess. And Adam's like, S catch me if you can! Ha! Eh, eh, slowly making his way across the pool. The dolphin offers his dorsal fin to Adam. He wants to give Adam a ride. Better touch. Wow, I accept! Adam cups his hand and the dolphin swims up under it and pulls Adam in swooping whirly around the... Whoa! Jane, stop this crazy thing! Do... <laughs> wow, that was fun. Hey, thanks. That was the greatest. <laughs> the dolphin looks really frisky now that he's pulled Adam around. He wants to play some more. Maybe it's time to get out of the pool. <laughs> get out of the pool. All right. I think now's the time for the frisbee. Oh, I need to get it out of my pack. Okay. Okay, uh, catch the frisbee. I got a point. Ding. Can I catch it? Can I catch it? Wait, where did he go with the... I'm supposed to give the frisbee back. Yeah. Can I catch it? Can I catch it? There's nothing that Adam needs. I want to catch the frisbee. I caught it. Okay, cool. I got some points. Let's do it again. And swing it, catch it, catch it, catch it. I got it. Oh, oh, under the leg. You see that? That was cool. That was shenanigans. Under the leg. Uh, under the leg again. Adam is a is an ultimate frisbee master. What? What? Look at this face. Uh If the dolphin just spoke, I wouldn't be that... Ooh, we belly flop pretty bad. I wouldn't be that in interested in <laughs> catching it again. Whoa! You talked? Did I? Oh, yeah. Uh, I guess I did. Uh, I guess the hermit's out of the crab, so to speak. Allow me to introduce myself, Adam. Um, and you know my name? Nothing wrong with my hearing. Above or under the water. Oh, look how fat he looks in the shot. As I was trying to say, if you didn't shut up for a second, my name's Delphinius. Del... er... what? Okay, <laughs> well... Oh, ah, oh, Jesus. Delphinius. Got it? Delphinius. Got it. Complicated name. Cetus, our great whale king named me. Of course, it sounds a lot different in our language. Sort of like... I believe you human scientists call that my signature whistle. I also speak tuna <laughs> and some of the more obscure coral dialects. Those are too high pitched for you to hear. Anyway, they're only useful in my kingdom. Cool! Your kingdom? Right, my kingdom, it's. Oh no! My kingdom, Cetus, I remember now! I don't know what I've been thinking! How long have I been here? He says, short-term amnesia. About a week. You were in pretty bad shape. A week? What a disaster! I've got to get out of here right away! Oh, no! 
Hold on, I'm not getting this. What are you talking about? What's the matter? Oh, that's me all over. Just rushing straight ahead and I'll look at where I'm going. That's how I... I sound like, like a bird. Polyglot cracker. <laughs> that's how I got into this mess in the first place. I don't know, that's my dolphin voice, okay? When I ran into that net, it's because I was searching for Cetus. He was missing and I was sent to find him. Maybe he's in trouble or hurt or worse. I have to find out before it's too late. Ah, please help me get out of here. Yeah, he's probably dead now. Oh, jeez. Of course I'll help you, Delphidius, my new best friend. Look at his eyes looking straight ahead, and Delphidius is like, Ah, a kid? Did he get off me? <laughs> he just rolled his eyes like, Whatever. <laughs> oh my God, this is so creepy. All right, now I have to open the cage. Can I toss a frisbee to him? Well, maybe just a couple more tosses, then I gotta go. <laughs> I know my I know my great whale king is is probably dead, but I just love the frisbee. Oh, but I get more points. I'm still getting points racked up. Can I do it again? Oh, I'm getting more points. I'm getting more points. I'm gonna do this. Until I get all, until I... What the? What? What? No! No! What is he doing? He's flying! What is he doing? No. What in the fuck is going? Never saw a dolphin do that before? That's because Adam's imagining it and so are you. Maybe you should get more sleep. Look at the face. Are you... What the? What is going on? Whoa! What? 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 The game just told you that you're crazy. Can I do it again? Can I do it again? Oh, the frisbee's gone. I guess that was... Okay, that was the end of the frisbee. Whatever, I got all the points. Okay, I think... Is it the gate here? Is that thing it? Or is that it? Oh, no, that was it. There, I've opened the hatch. Dad said you were almost ready anyway, so I know he wouldn't mind. <laughs> Hopefully, or otherwise he'll beat me blue. I guess this is it. I'd say thank you to your dad. I'd, I'd say to thank your dad, but I think you were nuts. Because <laughs> you just imagined me flying around the room. My dad might surprise you. He's pretty nuts himself. Are you sure you have to go? I want to see you fly some more. See, this is my king, Adam. If he needs my help, I can't fail him. But I won't forget you. I won't forget you either, Delphidius. Good luck. Good luck, Delphidius. Adam watches sadly as Delphidius swims out to sea. Bye-bye. I assume this is a wall, so I don't think he can see you waving. Oh, days pass. Days pass from Sponge SpongeBob reference. Still, days still wearing the same green shorts and no shirt. Familiar figure appears on the right. I wonder who it could be. It's a, it's a dolphin. We know that. Okay, game. We get it. it's a dolphin. We get it. It's a oh Jesus! Oh, that's a frightening Delphinius! Scared the shit out of me. I'm so glad to see you. I've been wondering what happened to you all week. Did you find your missing king? No, things are worse than ever. Gotta catch my breath. Ah, ah. Slow down. Take your time. What do you mean? Strange things are happening in the kingdom. Oh, it's too hard to explain. If only you could see it. Well, I could see it. I'll just go back there with you. You? A human? You must be joking. Human lungs could let Human lungs could never last where we're going. You'll have to get ready, Adam, before I can even consider it. Like, grow a blowhole! Alright, I guess I have to find diving equipment. Because we saw that he completed a course. It was it was framed. Phew, fresh mackerel. Good thing the dolphin likes it. I want it. Can I grab the net? No. Alright. Do, do, do. Taking my stuff. Whatever. There's an extra blonde wig if I need it. Oh, it's a transmitter. Picks up the diving equipment and the transmitter. Okay, now I'm ready. I've got everything. Hurry up, Edward. I have the worst feeling. We don't have much time. All right, well, I guess I'll 
put it on. And uh, Adam empties his pocket. Oh, we're like a seventh of the way through the game already. Just puts the flipper over his sandals. And, oh, sorry, I delete. And some kicky yellow gloves and his... Puts his gloves, fin, and mask and jumps into the water. Ah, right on top of me! You lead the way for a while, Adam. I'm still trying to get my sea legs back. Lead the way? I don't know where the fuck we're going. All right, well, I guess now's a good time to save and stop this episode. And as you can see, I, this is... I'm going to save over this... Holy oh, fuck, a talking dolphin. We're going to save here, and I'm going to see you next time on the search for Cetus, and we'll see where the fuck we're going.